Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Prime Minister. Well, we made the decision as a country, I think rightly, not to join the euro. Britain was still, you know, one of the biggest economies in the world. We're perfectly capable of having our own currency, our mm -hmm. own monetary policy, trying to have that that suits our own economy. And I've always felt it'd be a bad decision to join the euro because you've got, you know, 17 countries with 17 different governments, 17 different economic policies, often not always going in the same direction. And having your own currency gives you greater flexibility. It means you can have interest rates and policy that suits your own needs uh, rather than somebody else's. So we're not in the euro. We're not going to join the euro. We're going to keep the pound as our currency. Ooh. We're part of Europe. We trade. We cooperate. We work together. But I don't want to be part of a country called Europe. I want to be part of a country called Great Britain. I understand why it's a big issue in America, because it's to do with the Constitution, the right to bear arms, the history, the, the frontier society. I kind of understand that. Yes. But, you know, my country is very different, um, and the idea of, of uh, not having gun control, um, you know, I find, I find difficult. But, but that's why you have to respect each other's political traditions. Um, you know, I, as a conservative politician in the UK, I've, I've got on well with Republicans. I can get on well with Democrats. We, you know, we... Uh, we interfered a bit in your politics about 200 years ago when we sailed up the river and burnt down the White House. So sailed up the river. I've never uttered the words, I'm David Cameron and I approve this message. So, uh, <laughs> but so this, this figure will really, really amaze you. In order to become leader of the Conservative Party, which is the, one of the oldest political parties anywhere in the world, I fought a big campaign, had to travel all over the United Kingdom to, to win that campaign. I was allowed to spend the whole of the, whatever it was, four or five months, uh, $150,000. That was the limit on campaign finance.